Ultra rare moment, a vulnerable crab molts from its shell in front of a human. Take a look as the crab shows us exactly why nature is so amazing. In an occurrence that almost nobody would get to see in real life, this lucky person was able to capture this crab at the most incredible time. It's a long process, but the final result is worth the wait for this crab. The amazing moment was filmed in Galloway, New Jersey in the USA. The crab carefully pushes out of its shell as its limbs are at their most fragile at this point. The patient crab even has to push its eyes out of its shell. Crabs don't grow like most animals. Since they have a hard outer shell known as the exoskeleton that does not grow, they must shed their shells, a process called molting. Just as we outgrow our clothing, crabs, shrimps, and other crustaceans outgrow their shells. The crab is almost free, it just needs to keep going. A day before molting, crabs absorb seawater, swelling up like a balloon. This helps to expand the old shell and causes it to come apart at a special seam that runs around the body. The crab extracts itself from its old shell by pushing and compressing all of its appendages repeatedly. The slow and intricate process can take some crabs over 15 minutes, but this little guy is small, so he's getting there quicker. crab molts, it removes all its legs, its eye stalks, its antennae, all its mouth parts, and its gills. It leaves behind the old shell, the esophagus, its entire stomach lining, and even the last half inch of its intestine. Afterwards, the crab's new shell is very soft, which means the crab is susceptible to predators. However, within just a few days, the shell hardens up, and after a month returns to its typically hard, armor-like shell. Perhaps even more amazingly, crabs that have lost legs can regenerate them over time. The leg breaks off at a special joint before molting a new limb bud that grows out of its joint. Finally, the hardworking crab gets its reward and is finally freed from its old shell. But why do these amazing creatures need to do this? Apart from the straightforward reason of allowing the crab to grow, molting helps to get rid of parasites, barnacles, and other animals growing on the shell. It also helps to get rid of shells damaged by bacteria that degrade the chitin in the exoskeleton. This really is nature at its finest.